Hello again, and thanks for tuning in. Uh, so, um, another video. Uh, remember, some of you might remember, some of you might don't. Uh, there was a brake light error on there when I was doing the LED resistor video. So I'm going to show you how to change the light bulb. So if I turn it on, you can see there, there's a brake light uh, error. And it even says, what a smart car. So the first thing you need to do, take the, oh, turn it off and go into a, that trusty garage of yours full of tools in the back of your car. And this time you're going to need this there. It might look like a handle, but it isn't. It is actually a screwdriver. Okay, so you're going to need this tool. <clears throat> ah, it doesn't close because it's there. Stay in there. Ah, okay, so I was told that this bulb has burnt out by a smart car, which is very smart, and by my mate. So what you need to do is clip that. Uh, we haven't got a clip there. Because it's been already lost by the previous owner. Thank you, previous owner. Okay, so you need to do undo. That's either a star or just flat screwdriver. And the bottom one. Undo that as well. gonna need to take these out I'm gonna need two hands there we are I've got them out you can see there you can use a star symbol tool I don't know what they call those stars or just a flat screwdriver which you've got already in your tool station underneath your car okay so now the headlamp or oh, no not the headlamp but the tail light is loose what you need to do is unclip it from there there's like a clip there which releases uh, I want to show you how it's done <clears throat> but whether I'll be able to with one hand Probably not. I need some fingers to get in there. I've just unclipped it and clipped it back in. I'll try and show you this. Okay, so prize a little bit there so you can get your fingers in there. And then with your other hand, get some fingers. And there we go. And it's out. And then it's just a clip on the back and you get your light out okay I've got some bulbs here these are 12 volts 21 W's I think yeah 21 W 4 watts 12 volt um, those are offset so you can see one is higher one is short uh, shorter one is lower and they are offset of the center. Okay, so let's unclip those. And take this thing out so I can change the bulb. Oop. So that's the one in question. This one has burnt out. It usually twists and you take it out. There we are. Now the new one. And you only need to get this offset, otherwise you won't be able to put it in because this has the same offset for for the bulb to fall in. So you can only put it in one way. 
so both of those contacts are usable okay now I push it in and turn okay let's put it back together there we are okay so now just uh, reconnect there and that's the popper that I was telling you about so that's where you just need to pull it, pull it and it will just pop out it's not a bolt nothing's holding it's just a popper so you position the headlamp again put the popper in and push and that's it then what you need to do is to do those up okay so I'll put the screws in tighten it a bit loosely you don't want to tighten one and then tighten another you need to go all the way just because before it catches then check for gaps you might need to push the headlamp in and then tighten it I can't find it there it is now then yeah that's it done now put the cover in the only one we've got oh nearly lost it okay okay the cover is in now let's see whether the car tells us we've done a good job a great job or a perfect job okay what do we have beautiful no error brakes are being pressed no error job well done the light bulb changed okay so thanks for tuning in thanks for watching you want more videos subscribe you want to know when more videos are coming hit that bell button or whatever it's called thanks bye bye